Well, <laughs> um, welcome back to Doom Eternal. Well, that was interesting. Uh, where we left off, we just finished this. <laughs> um, thank you to each and every one of you that's joining me on this still. Um, it really means the world to me to have your support. Um, we're doing a giveaway for a copy of this game on, on a platform of your choice. Um, what you got to do to enter is like, comment, and subscribe, and that's it. But uh, no, it really means the world to me for everyone that's uh, joining me for this. You know, this is a lifelong dream of mine, come true. And you guys are the ones making it possible. So yeah, I thought I'd leave that little uh, that little bit in there where I was um, having to re-kill every group. Um, and the reason I thought I'd leave it in was it was really badass. <laughs> It was really cool. Um, if I'd known that I'd have to have uh, redone that entire section, I probably wouldn't have ended the episode where I did. <laughs> um, God, we really need it. All right, no fuel. <laughs> yeah, um, I was. I've been uh, really enjoying the game. I mean, I'm very far behind. Um, I know, and. Uh, People are still making my dream a reality, even though there is plenty of other walkthroughs out there. Um, hopefully, we'll be hitting the Marauder this episode. Uh, I hope so, anyway. Um, the Marauder, I've heard, is a pain in the end. Um, so yeah, <laughs> not looking forward to the fight. I'd love to see if I could do it first try, though. Um, yeah, I don't know whether I've made a mistake leaving in that last little fight, like fighting area or not. <laughs> but uh, it was a really cool fight. I didn't want you guys having to miss out on it if uh, I could avoid that. Okay. Big ass gun. <clears throat> right. No. <laughs> so yeah, I've, I've been really looking forward to getting to this part. Apparently this is like... Um, one of the, the biggest areas that you go to, the Ark Complex. Um, don't know why my audio seems really quiet today. <laughs> On the uh, playback it does anyway. <laughs> Man. I hope you guys are having fun uh, with all this lockdown stuff going on. I know that can be hard. I know there's a lot of a lot of crap happening, you know. Not much to really celebrate, but... I hope you guys are still finding a reason. Seen enough hentai to know where this is going, eh? <laughs> Man, I, I mean, the channel's nearly at 60 subscribers as of last checking, which is fantastic. Our views hit over, like, I think it was over 600 or something the other day. Um, it means the world to me. I, I know I keep saying it, but it really does mean a lot to me to uh, be doing this for you guys. Uh, like, really, it does. Um, I could never put into words just <laughs> how much it all means. <laughs> I do, I love you all. Uh, you're all making this, you know, one hell of a ride. Uh, I don't even mean for the joke, but I keep saying it. <laughs> um, no, for real. Wouldn't have it any other way. Terrible jokes and a really supportive community. <laughs> and I still need to get the uh, ultimate upgrade for that. Or at least I think I do. I think I do because I earned that in the last room. And, um... Because I had to replay Our through everything I had like unlocked from there. <laughs> Earth must be cleansed. The UAC are really like <laughs> they're really different in this, you know. I think my mic's really low. Because, there we go. <laughs> my mic sensitivity wasn't high. <laughs> Typical. Oh, I bet you there's like a secret or something up there. Uh. Oh man. You know what? Self-fulfilling chainsaw. Why should we waste it? Hmm? <laughs> you know what? I do not like his attitude. <laughs> I love the little pop noise. <laughs> right, so I can go back this way. I wonder whether he can jump the gap. I'm assuming so. I think I hit his tail with that one. <clears throat> I hope I did. <laughs> so I do not have the ammo to waste on a pinky. <laughs> oh, come on. Just take it easy on me. <laughs> I'm still trying to find out why my mic sensitivity is so low. <laughs> there we go. Oh. 
That's one of my rules of thumb right there. If you joined me in the first episode, you'd know. If you're going on the right path, go the wrong way. These guys seem to be, like, a lot more tanky than your average dude. These prayer to token things are, um... Really starting to mount up, but I don't really know what upgrades I want with them, you know? Like, if we have a look at the suit... Like... Oh, wait, no, I did. I went through and upgraded the ice bomb. <laughs> I'm lying to you guys. You know I don't mean it. <laughs> Alright. Ice bomb just did not want to hit anything there. That's always good. <laughs> we're gonna have to blood punch, I think. But yeah, we're gonna have to blood punch. There we go. <laughs> I love how the blood punch literally just encourages you to punch everything in the game. <laughs> Like, if there's a problem, Doomslayer here, he solves it through punching. Oh, I thought I'd, like, managed to just survive that, that little drop there. <clears throat> by no means am I going through for, like, a full collectible run, by the way. Um, but, you know, there, there will be quite a few in the guide, I guess. Not in the guide, but uh, in the playthrough, so... Now, feel free to watch just for them. It's totally up to you. <laughs> I just appreciate having an audience that's supporting me this far. Um... You know, I really hope that we can get to the uh, the point where I can do this full time for everybody because you know all I want really from this channel is to be able to give uh, give back to people. You know the YouTube community supported me through so much um, in life, and that's all I want to do back is uh, support the community. <laughs> but, um, no, it's it's really strange um, to, to even see that we've got this many subs as it is. Right? Never have seen this come a reality like, in my head, you know. <laughs> God, I, I'm not really a fan of haste, <laughs> but it does also seem to increase like your reload speed or whatever. So maybe I can let it slide this once. Oh, I love this song. I keep going quiet whenever this song comes on. <laughs> It's just so badass. <laughs> I'm still waiting for the soundtrack to come out digitally. <laughs> oh, I thought I had my... Um... <laughs> that was so perfectly timed with the shot of my gun, Jesus. <laughs> I've genuinely been considering turning this into a silent playthrough. <laughs> like, no commentary. So you guys get to enjoy this beautiful music. I didn't even mean to be quiet during this whole fight. I just, um, you know, people keep asking me as well while my mic balances so that the game is pretty much always above me. And it's because you guys came for the game. You didn't come for me. You know what I mean? <laughs> I understand that. I respect that. <laughs> so I try and keep the, um, the game like the main focus of the episode. Ah, oh, that's a few of them done. The challenge. If I was a lot more efficient, I would have got that challenge done in like three areas ago. <laughs> I hear another... The fact that the song is still... 
There's gotta be something, right? <laughs> I'm not sure, <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, I mean, you guys came for the game, not really for my commentary, which is like something I really understand and really respect, almost, like, yeah, I'd love to get it to the point where my commentary is like one of the main things that this channel is known for, but uh, <laughs> I would understand if it's not. <laughs> Here I am from the UK, I'm not even blessed with one of the good UK accents. <laughs> Cursed with one of the most common. <laughs> ah, okay, this is how it's gonna be. Oh, this ain't good. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, come on, man. This is like I don't, I don't like this purple stuff. <laughs> I do not like this purple stuff one bit. Oh man, okay. <laughs> That's that done. <laughs> oh, I am not a fan of it. This purple stuff that makes you move really slow and you can't jump. Because the whole thing about this game is it's momentum, you know what I mean? Like keeping on. And, um. Having something that really forces you to stop and slow everything down, it's like... It kind of sucks. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't really have a lot of, um, a lot of ammo to be facing these guys at close range. <laughs> okay. So, I think that's it. Yeah. <laughs> Hope to God I've not missed any collectibles. Sentinel, we got that, we got that. The snake that we're going up to, I almost feel like we're going to fight that, that gore nest without uh, the choice, essentially. But, um, God, man, Doom Eternal, it's really kicked up as well, because its first couple of episodes were a bit like, the game was putting in its mode, like, it's, I want to say it's like, it's pedestal, because it, it kind of does, Doom is, are we going back down? What? What the? What the hell? The door just... The door just closed on me again. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying. Yeah, Doom... I, at least Eternal, anyway, is kind of this game that has its own its own category, kind of. Yes, it's an FPS, but it's kind of, it's very different. It's not really an arcade-style FPS. It's not really a, like a major, typical card-style FPS. Um, but, you know, it kind of builds its own little place, and I think that's what the first couple of episodes of this really did. Um, I will be doing like a review at the end of every series I do, if that's something that people are interested in. Um, they can just let me know. Um, like in the comments or on one of my social medias or something, but um, that's the thing, like, I still need to do a review for Kakarot, uh, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I heard a DLC is coming out for that at some point, and it's the only reason I haven't done a review so far, is I thought I'd you know, wait for that DLC to come out and maybe I can do the review alongside showcasing the DLC. Um, Doom Eternal is getting campaign DLCs, which I think is fantastic, because I keep saying it with Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, the game is fantastic, but it's too short. Yeah, I know, the game took me over 30 hours to complete, but I was going through and doing collectibles and side quests and so on. But it, it, it was really short, there wasn't really a lot of bulk to it, and I kind of feel that a bit with Doom Eternal. Um, we can go back and replay missions, which is something I am considering doing, because I've not got every single um, one of the Slayer Gates. Um, so, you know, I, I just, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I will be doing a review, and I, th I feel like Doom had a long time in the campaign where it, it settles itself kind of thing. One moment. Override <laughs> successful. Love Doom Guy's little impatient button clicks. <laughs> it's me. It's me right now. You can access Dr. Hayden's outpost. I was really worried that it was coming through my TV at the same time. <laughs> um, but no, I love the game. I love... Oh. 
don't think we were supposed to see that. <laughs> yeah, it's um, it's been fantastic so far. I'm uh, I'm hoping you guys are enjoying it. I honestly feel for anybody who hasn't been able to get themselves a copy, um, because you know this is phenomenal. Everybody deserves the opportunity to play this, to enjoy this. Please tell me I can go back. I can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh no. No. <laughs> you just you cheated. You cheated. Everybody saw you do that. <laughs> um yeah, the, the, like I said, the giveaway that's going on. All you got to do is like, comment, and subscribe. Hopefully, you know, enough people do enter if they haven't managed to get themselves a copy. Because again, you know, my heart goes out to you. This game's great. <laughs> it really is. Um, and anything that you can do to try and get your hands on a copy, you need to do because it's like you can't miss out on this much. <laughs> um, yeah, my commentary is still terrible. I'm still getting there. Um, you guys, with your you know comments, your feedback, they really help. Uh, like more than I could ever find it was. <laughs> um, I'm still getting like decent at the game. I've been thinking of covering like loads of other things instead of just walkthroughs and stuff. Um, I had some friends say that they'd love to see me put some of my multiplayer games on here, um, which I'd be interested in doing. Maybe some Call of Duty or something. Um, I was thinking of doing like a breakdown of all of the attachments on there because I have quite a few friends that come to me for attachment guides and stuff. Um, like they ask me what attachments work best because I'm one of those people that really like to pick apart the small details so like I don't know what barrel gives you what meter amount of range and stuff you know because <laughs> I'm a nerd <laughs> uh, that much is, is common knowledge now though. <laughs> I really wish we had the oh my god <laughs> The amount of free damage I just got from that. Like, ooh. This guy's really annoying, sort of in a blood punch. <laughs> uh, I want a bit of armor, so you can give me that. And there we go. <laughs> Man, that was so nice. I heard there's actually an achievement for punching a Slayer Gate, <laughs> which uh, I'm yet to do. Um, we'll, we'll go through and we'll find all of like the secret achievements together. I do have my notifications turned off when I'm playing through a game um, on YouTube, only for the fact that sometimes the Xbox notification noise can be ridiculously loud. Uh, and on top of that, you know, I don't really want pop-ups appearing in the middle of, I don't know, like a cutscene or something. All our personnel, the mortally challenged have turned to compound. Oh, Evacuation is advised. Okay. You're mine. And quad damage. Oh. Thank god we got none of that on ourselves. You know? Completely self immune. If that's even the right phrasing for it. Oh man, I really thought I was going to do like a badass jump shot there. <laughs> he just took that rocket with his forehead, man. Poor guy. I wonder whether there's anything on this bridge collectible wise. No. There's a collectible up here that I wanted to go and get. In fact, I think we did get that collectible when we originally went through it, which sucks because <laughs> we can't go back there now. <laughs> oh man, we'll have to go through and just do like a collectible guide or something. <laughs> but no, I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, Doom, Doom Eternal. Fantastic game, amazing execution. Uh, I'm glad that I'm not like putting out as much as I could video-wise because I like to do little kind of mini in-episode reviews like oh this is working this isn't um, I think it gives off a lot more of a uh, almost like a personal touch and it's almost like you guys are beside me playing the game yourselves um, on top of that like I kind of you know I kind of said this in a couple of episodes now that um, a lot of reviews and stuff when it comes to a game 
can be very negatively impacted or even positively impacted by uh, the hype for a game. You know what I mean? You know, like, you know, Doom Eternal's coming out. Oh my god, 10 out of 10. You've also got. Oh? My god. Um, uh, Dr. Hayden was uh, convinced uh, that you'd come here for this eventually. Uh, can I just say that it is an honor for me personally to meet you? I. Oh. <laughs> Doom guy has no time for your Attention. fanboying. Emergency protocols have been activated. Please exit the facility now. Oh, he's seen a lot better days. We uh we don't know how to access his main cortex. It's all alien. We couldn't figure it out. We have to uh, prepare for his careful extraction. <laughs> we were given specific orders. <laughs> careful <laughs> signal is barely readable. Warning. Demonic presence, threat level five, entering main laboratory. Oh, here it is. Opening the portal now. He sounds stand too close, he uses shotgun stand too far, he throws projectiles, keep him mid-range, counter his attacks when his eyes flash green. Okay. 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 We got this. <clears throat> They're playing our song, time to dance, yeah? We've got to try and keep an eye on his eyes. <clears throat> okay, so our rockets can hit him from behind. Oh my god. I hope to god we get this first try, believe me, ladies and gents. <laughs> oh, I'm ruining this whole entire thing right now. <laughs> okay, so he dodges them as well. That dog thing, that's annoying. Okay, we managed to get a little bit of it there. <laughs> okay, this is this is something else. If I'm having a whole heap of fun. Oh no, come on, blood punch. So we wanna kind of get close enough for him to do his little leaping attack thing. <laughs> It's definitely going to be a pain, this boss fight, as I can tell you that much. So he dodged that. He did take that, then. He did take that frost grenade. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We really need everything that we can get right now. <laughs> oh, we just dodged that. <laughs> oh, what the... These guys are the annoying things, because their flamethrowers do a lot of damage. I'm like panicking right now. Oh man, it's this dog thing as well. A lot of damage.
Oh, okay. This is like one of them things, isn't it? That's going to happen more than once. He's not a real boss because he's... Oh, man. I don't even know whether my shield blocks his. Thankfully his dog spawned up there. Again, he took that frost one. That one. <laughs> He really does hit like a truck as well. No ammo. Need all we can get. <laughs> His dog's gonna be here soon, isn't it? Yeah. There's a lot of damage as well that dog does. He, he hits with a super shotgun as well, which is snake else. Oh! Oh, we just did it first try. Holy Jesus! <laughs> Man. That's the art complex, that's the Marauder fight. Man, I was looking forward to that. I had a lot of people telling me that it was going to be difficult, telling me that I had to prepare for it. First try, ladies and gents. I'm happy that you guys gave me the opportunity to do that. Thank you to each and every one of you that's joining me. A reminder of the giveaway, just like, comment, subscribe. Keep supporting this channel. I'll keep supporting you. Love you all. Take care and see you in the next episode.